Yo, what's going on guys? I'm back with another video and today I am back on Hydrix and as you know, this is one of my favorite RSPS that is live right now. Anyways, I will be hosting a side of Vitter giveaway. Now this is a huge and awesome giveaway because this is the only side of Vitter that will be in game. There is none in game right now and I am giving away the first one that will be in game. So definitely make sure you enter this huge giveaway and hope for this super awesome site. Anyways, let's go ahead and jump right into the video. Alright, so right now I am going to showcase some of the latest updates which are the old school RS wilderness bosses. Now if you go to teleports, bossing teleports, then click on the standards and you scroll down, you will see a bunch of the wilderness bosses. As you can see you have Callisto, you have Venonatus, Chaos Fanatic, Cra Crazy Archaeologist and Scorpia. So yeah, that's really nice. So right now we are going to Callisto first, as you can see he can drop the tyrannical range and an easy clue scroll so let's have a look here and if we go to Callisto um, he will be somewhere around here all right so Callisto is just a little bit to the southwest of the teleport and as you can see there I just actually one hit him but if we have a look here you can get like a dragon pickaxe dragon to H sword the tyrannical ring and a bunch of other items you can also get juice you seeds magic seeds and palm tree seeds as a rare drop which are of course worth quite a lot of money also all these other drops that are more uncommon and common these are also really good drops as you can see you get high amounts of all these items which are good for scaling and stuff so yeah that's really nice now of course there is also venonatus so here we go here we go teleporting to venonatus as you can see right here it is so it looks really cool as well once again i just one bang all these bosses so um yeah let's have a look here to the drops real quick so also the dragon pickaxe tyrant uh, no treasurous ring and the dragon to a sword and then of course you have all these uncommon and common drops as well so um yeah it looks pretty much the same as the Callista drop list it's really good for scaling once again and standard money making so yeah pretty nice all right going to the third boss on the list which is the chaos fanatic now you will get teleported straight next to it as you can see right here so attacking it real quick easy to kill uh, again so uh, yeah they don't have a lot of hp which is really nice so you can get the kills pretty easy as well um, but scrolling down you can get an ojum and malediction shot one hit of course you will need to go to other bosses to get a two and three as well but um, yeah, let's have a look here. The other drops are also pretty good. You can also get like 40 40k cash, ancient stuff as well, which is uh, pretty nice. And then split buck, of course. So yeah, this is another really great money making for beginner players as well. And they are pretty easy to, ki uh, to kill. Also, if you get these, you'll get like a lot of money. So yeah, that's super nice. Now the next boss to go over is the crazy archaeolog archaeologist, as you can see right here. So this is also a pretty easy boss. They don't have like a lot of HP, um, but as you can see, you get teleported in the house, so you'll have to run around. But um, yeah, let me just kill it real quick. As you can see, pretty easy there. But this one drops the Ogium and Maldiction Shard too. So this is the second boss that you will have to kill to actually go ahead and make yourself the Ogium or Maldiction Ward. But um, yeah, besides that, like, once again, all these other really cool drops. Oh, and actually, <laughs> the crazy archaeologist just got an improved drop rate, as you can see in the chat box with the boss spotlight. So um, yeah, a lot of people will be coming here now just to get that chance of getting that Ojum or Maldiction shot. And of course, last but not least, we have Scorpia right here in the Scorpia dungeon as well. So yeah, that's pretty nice as well. Uh, once again, doesn't have a lot of HP and this one actually drops the, uh, come on, can I see drop list real quick? Oh, I just missed it. Okay, I'll be back in a second. Okay, so I just can't really see it because I just get attacked way too fast and I can't actually look at the drop list. Um, but Scorpio drops the Maldiction and Ojum shard 3, so this will be the final piece that you will need to actually go ahead and make yourself the, uh, what's it called? Uh, to make yourself the Ojum and Maldiction Ward. So yeah, that's pretty nice as well. Of course, once again, it will have some other regular drops as well. And um, yeah, that's pretty cool. Anyways, if you, as you may have noticed, I got some of the Sphere Dust while I was killing the bosses. Now, this is because of the Halloween event that is going on right now. Also, the home area is nicely decorated, as you can see with all these pumpkins and stuff. So yeah, it's really nice to see that they put some work into the events as well. But if you actually open the store, you can buy yourself some customs, right? Uh, some cosmetics right here, like the side, the Jack Lantern mask, pumpkin. You can even buy an eek if you want to and some of these other really cool items. So yeah, it's a really nice event. It's a kind of a smaller event, but of course they have a fully other event as well. So yeah, definitely make sure to join in game to test that out. 
Anyways, right now I am going to be opening some of the new donator boxes, which are 200 uber donator boxes. Now, of course, I will be speeding up this clip. So, um, yeah, as you can see, you can get some really cool items from these. You can get a Bond Anger Spear. Um, they also have just been redone so you can get like super insane items from these you can actually get a sight of fitter from these if you are super lucky but um yeah i'm going to open all of these and let's see if i can get lucky so there we have it that was the last box open and as you guys can see we made six billion cash from that alone we got three super rare rewards as you can see the last one was one billion cash in one box which is super insane but as you can see we also got two uh, two bill cash here two bill cash here and then of course another two bill in the inventory Besides that, we got ourselves a twisted bow somewhere in the, oh, right here it is, and also the code I want, um, which I have in this tab already, or the other tab somewhere um, right here from opening the Zolra boxes earlier in another video. But we also got 36 Dead Touch darts, which is super nice for bossing, of course, and then, of course, all these other items like next items. So that's super insane loot and super nice to get. Now, this is where I will go and end off today's video. I hope you guys definitely did enjoy this video on Hydrix. Once again, this server is super awesome, so definitely make sure you come and check it out. Also, make sure you check out those definitely nice uh, uh, wilderness bosses and get some easy money off those. And don't forget to enter this awesome giveaway of the side of Wither, which once again will be the first one that will come in game. As you saw, I opened 200 boxes and didn't get one, so it's super rare to get. Of course, you can always get lucky on the boxes, but... Um, definitely make sure you enter this giveaway by liking, subscribing and commenting your in-game name. Also make sure you turn on the notifications so you get, uh, you get notified when I upload another video for more giveaways and stuff. Anyways, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you smash the like button and subscribe if you didn't already. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.